Welcome back. We are Two Girls and a Growler. My name is Chrissy and... I'm Sheila. We're coming at you today with a new beer. We haven't even tried this beer. This is going to be a surprise for all of us. So it is Waddle by Abel Baker. It is 4.4 AVB. There you go. You got it. I did it right this time. Go flat. Go flat. <laughs> Uh, we actually just went down to the brewery this afternoon, took a little look, it's got some great stuff. You guys can check out the pictures on our Instagram and Facebook. That, that was fun. Captain? Um, so, what's this about? When we get the... Flight. <laughs> second time, second time. Usually it's you. When we get the flight, <laughs> they give you a duck on your flight and... He came home with us. What the duck? Quit ducking around. Let's get back to business. But look at my ducky. Stop showing your duck too. You want to see my duck? Look at my duck. Look at my duck. Okay. I'm done with the duck. <laughs> all right. So we actually ended up getting a flight at Abel Baker, and it turns out all the beers that we wanted to do for today's episode, um, they only come in a can. And since we're not two girls in a can, we are two girls in a growler. We're actually going to do a blind react to the waddle. This is the one that we didn't try, but we are both looking forward to it. It is hazy. It is a hazy IPA. Um, again, it's the 4.4. Okay, here we go. All right. <laughs> and for the opens, let's get it nice next to the mic so you guys can all hear. Oh, okay. Just a mini one today. Just a nice little... A quick, an but easy so one. far, it does have some nice head in there. I mean, you can't see it, but we'll show you. All right, go ahead and pour. Get a nice one. All right, so we're going to let that settle for a second. The growler's actually Ooh, super. Oh, no, no. I'm good at getting head. What? <laughs> Perfect amount of head. <laughs> Uh, check out the growler on that. That is super cute. I love the little duck. How adorable does that say? What does the growler say? Quarantine growler. That's pretty dope. Super cute. Rona. <laughs> so, so far, again, it's got some nice head on there, nice bubbles. Uh, the color's beautiful, nice little light haze. It's not super hazy, which is amazing. It's got some nice little bubbles going. Let's give it a little taste. I like to get a little taste with the bubbles. Oh, it smells really pretty. It's definitely very floral. Oh, that's definitely. That's I like that. Mm. Oh, I got all head. <laughs> Excuse me. I uh, actually really like the hops flavor on this. It does have a little bit of citrus, but. It is pretty hoppy. Not like overly strong hops, but like you get that nice floral hop going. Yeah, it's definitely, you definitely get the floral and you go in and you smell it. And you, it um, yeah. And taste it. I finally got beer. <laughs> Yay! Um, yes, no, it's, it's definitely that citrus. I don't know if that's more, if it's more orange. I'm picking up a little bit of an orange. What do you think? Is it orange? I can't put my thumb on it. Right? It is. It's definitely a citrus, but I can't decide. It's not very... Grapefruit? Very, it's like a... I don't know. With the hops and the citrus, it just kind of brings me to a grapefruit flavor. But it's really not like, oh my gosh, I just ate a grapefruit. Just a little bit of tartness. It's like a, yeah, like a tarty grapefruit. Yeah, that's about like a lemon grapefruit. Maybe. A little bit. Mm, I don't know. It doesn't really give us a lot of detail on what kind of citrus fruit it is, but really it depends on your palate because every beer is going to taste different to every person. Like, um, I'll taste the caramel. She'll taste the oak. Yeah. Vice versa. <laughs> it just depends. Um, and this is very, I would say it's, it's very, it is crisp. I do like how crisp it is. Definitely a lighter beer. Um, we definitely should have gotten a bigger growlers if it's only a 4.4. I know. And it's really light, so I hey, do like the hey, lightness. Hey. We ducked up. We ducked up completely. <laughs> Don't duck and chudge us. 
be duck and jealous. <laughs> <sighs> Alright, I'm done ducking around, I promise. <laughs> no, she's not, really, she's not. <laughs> so, um, you do taste uh, that it is a lighter IPA, so that is great, especially with summer coming. Today, for some reason, it's like 90 here, but I was dying, it was hot. So it's definitely this, more of a humid day today. Yeah, this is a great beer for a day like today though, where it's warm out. You got that heaviness already on you. You don't want something heavy in your stomach. So definitely a light IPA. I really like that. I like the flavor. It's got some good body. I'm always talking about bodies. She really, <laughs> she really does like her body. <laughs> Look at that body. <laughs> I work out. Except I don't. We don't. <laughs> We drink more beer. Hey, we are working out. We are lifting these glasses. They are. Like, look. This is this is heavy. It's so heavy. Her only problem is with the 64 ounce because she's, she's so short and the table's kind of high. <laughs> it's not my fault. I'm a munchkin from the lollipop guild, okay? I'm travel size for your convenience. What are you referencing? <laughs> don't hit me. I don't. It is a good beer, though. Like I said, it's really light. It's got a good body. Got a good flavor. Not overly hoppy. And I, I know that some people don't like IPAs for that reason because they get that floral flavor and they're not comfortable with it or they don't like it. This is one that it's actually pretty smooth. Um, it's not overly floral. No, or, you definitely get the floral in the smell, but you don't get it in the taste. Yeah. Um... So it makes it a little easier to drink for those who don't like it in IPA because of just the floral taste. And it's light enough to where you could chug. Just be careful. <laughs> It'll sneak up on you. It will. Nice thing about Abel Baker, though, it is also part of Brewery Row. Uh, it's on Main Street. It's towards the end of Main Street. Uh, get heading closer to the, the strat, stratosphere for all of us locals who actually know um but the great thing about abel baker is that they actually have a really good craft kitchen uh partnered with them i don't know if anyone has ever gone to 595 over on rainbow and excuse me you're excused what is it rainbow and god what's it called? tropicana yes rainbow and tropicana yes so 595 is amazing it is a tap room more than or craft beer tap room i guess you would say but their food is amazing yeah, good treats. They're the best treats. Take my word for it. <laughs> so the food at Abel Baker is delicious. It's the same owner um, that runs their kitchen from five nine five. So you're gonna you're gonna get those bur those delicious craft burgers. I highly highly recommend the hot sick chicken sandwich. I'm a little bit of a whip when it comes to heat, so I get mine with the buffalo sauce. Wow, delicious. Thank I you, man personally like the cauliflower and i believe they're called garbage fries they're like the best fries i've ever had and their fry sauce oh, so amazing so good so check them out you guys uh abel baker definitely has a wide selection of different types of beer and it's in an amazing area their location their actual um tap well their actual brewery uh it's actually it's gorgeous it is beautiful, and they have such a great setup. So you have tables inside, you have some outside, um, and even if it gets overcrowded, they actually have extra seating around the brewery. Well, this brewery setup, I should say. So you could be up close to those big old huge brewers. <laughs> I don't know what they're called. Tanks. Thank you. Brewing tanks. Brewing tanks. But it was really cool because we actually got to sit right next to them, and we got to kind of see them working around. So that's really interesting to be able to look at. Also, um, we did meet a lot of cool people that just go in to visit. So if you are in that area and you are a beer lover like us, mm -hmm. go check them out. Because we definitely recommend Waddle and a few of their other beers. Uh, try the flights. They are reasonable and And you fun. get a ducky. Oh, and the glasses are so cute. Who doesn't want a ducky? I want another ducky. Let's go get a ducky. Ducky! I don't know. I was jealous of the duck that the other guy got. He got a duck with a mohawk, and then he came back with a duck with double cow. 
Yeah, they gave him all the cool ducks. We got the lame duck. Yeah. <laughs> get, it, get it, get it, get it, get it, lame duck. <laughs> lame duck. We're all about the dad jokes today, you guys. You're duck and lame. Check out our Facebook, Instagram, and when we do start up with the TikTok videos, since we do have the TikTok, but we haven't done anything in it yet, we'll be sure to let you guys know. We'll update it in our comments here on YouTube and Facebook and Instagram. Check out our videos and our photos. Yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe. Um, if you guys have any comments, leave them down at the bottom. We love to hear what you guys think. Uh, also, if you want to be here with us, drinking some beer, drinking some beer, talking some smack, having fun, we do have that cash app now. Donate a growler, a filled growler, please. I have enough glasses as it is. And your local. I mean, if you're going to fly in, uh, that's all on you, babe. <laughs> it's got to be all local beer, but we would greatly appreciate it, and we'll get you on the, uh, get you on the show. Definitely. Or if you are out of the state of La Nevada and you do want to just donate anyways, uh, you can see our Cash App posted on our Facebook and Instagram. You can donate whatever amount you want to. You could help fill the growlers. And we can give you a shout out while we're doing the episode. Can. We will. We will give you a shout out. It really out. depends on what your name is. If it has something inappropriate, we'll still fucking say it. <laughs> yeah. Please. Please. <laughs> I want to see the weird names. I have no problem with that. If you want to hear me say some dumb shit, do it. I'll sign her up. All right, so that's it for today. Again, this is Waddle, Abel Baker, 4.4 AVB. She got it. I did it twice today. Go ahead and check them out. Uh, thanks for joining us. Take care. Have a good one, you guys. Bye.